Spy. My name is Ella Lahabi. I'm from Far West, and I'm a junior at Shomri Torah Synagogue. My dad was born in Israel, so I spend every summer there, and I speak fluent Hebrew. Last December, I went to Israel with an exchange program called Partnership, and there we met up with this organization called Sima On Lechibu, which translates to the thirst for a hug. And what this organization does is it runs daycares for the children of Eritrean and Sudanese refugees. They come to Israel on foot without documents to escape oppressive regimes or conditions in their own countries. And they have no papers, so they can't become citizens or receive social services. So what this organization provides for them is daycares that they can put their children in while they work, and medical care for their children as well. This summer, I met up with the organization again. I went into Tel Aviv to volunteer in one of these daycares a total of five times. The first thing you notice when you enter is that these kids, they swarm around you. They're looking for attention, for love and validation. And there's only about two caretakers, since it's a nonprofit, for about 25 kids. It's a small room, and there's not much time spent outdoors because the outside area is small as well. Um, they usually nap for about three hours, and when I came and volunteered, I'd come for two hours before or after their nap time, and I'd play with them. I'd let them climb on me. Uh, one of the kids really liked to floss, so he always challenged me to down softs, and I can't say no to that, you know. Um, and it was a lot of fun. It made me really happy to go there and to see them having fun and enjoying life. This isn't something that you hear about a lot. And in USY, we talk Israel, we talk food. We talk politics, we talk culture, language, music, but we never talk about the minorities, we never talk about the Arabs, we never talk about the Druze, we never talk about the African refugees who aren't Jewish. But why should we care if they aren't Jewish? We shouldn't care because they aren't Jewish, we should care because we are, and because as part of Tikkun Olam, they are our responsibilities, because we were refugees in foreign countries, and we needed these services. And the Israel I support, it's not an Israel that rejects refugees, it's not an Israel that says, we don't care about you. It's an Israel that supports them, that brings them in, and that lets them integrate into its society, because that is what the Jews needed at one point. So maybe we should support them too. So please, if you hear the story and if it moves you, bring it to your chapters, bring it to your region, open dialogue, open dialogue about the refugees in Israel, because they exist, and their stories are just as important as yours and mine. And if you want to help donate to this organization to fund the daycares, the website is tzimaon.co.il, T-Z-I-M-A-O-N.co.il. Thank you for hearing my story. It's hard to look right.